We got three weeks to turn this backyard and get it ready for a wedding. Let's go. doing some DIY decorations for the wedding. So these are gonna be the flower girl pots, flower girl baskets. Good morning, you two. It's five o'clock. We woke up this morning because Brandy and I smell a really bad skunk odor in the house. So we thought our house got sprayed. We walked around the house. We didn't see nothing. It could be a gas leak and it could be explosive. Yeah, there's the, there's the Unisaurus Tex truck. He's in the back right now. He said we're all chilling in the ride right now. We've probably been in here for uh, about a good 45 minutes or so. Um, girls are back there. King's right there on the other. King's wide awake. He's a morning person. And um, yeah, we're just chilling right now. So hopefully it's a quick fix. And yeah, good thing we got out of there because like, have you guys ever heard of those stories about families who sleep through a gas leak and they people come by and they are, they're all passed away? So it was a good thing that we didn't play around with this. We got out the house like they just said. We follow the instructions, so we're hoping everything is good. We get back in the house and we could go to sleep. The Unisaur Sky left and he said all the tests came back good. He said that he did smell skunk coming around the block. He said he drove around for like 10 minutes and he said he smelled skunk. And that's what we smelled earlier, but it's still in the house, but there's no gas leak. So we're just trying to get the skunk smell out now. We mopped the floors and we're just waiting for it to dry now. Honey, how do you feel about waking up at four o'clock this morning with the skunk smell? Hey, they want something smells in our house, and everybody's still sleeping except for King. Mama's still sleeping, and I'm tired too, and I feel like I have stuck smell on me. Baby, how do you feel? Yeah, me too. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. <laughs> 